Alright, hi people, it is Shakespeare, and I'm here to do an unboxing race today of Kick Ass, the 4K Blu ray and digital HD combo pack uh, of this movie. So, yeah, um, so you got all the main characters on the front. Um, and yeah, I've heard this is a, a really good movie. And it even says right there from USA Today, irreverently entertaining. So, yeah. Uh, so, it's the front, you got the side right here. I don't get why they're doing slipcovers like this for, um, in terms of this style for 4K releases. Uh, doesn't make sense to me. But yeah. And the other side, um, so yeah. One of the most wildly entertaining, crowd pleasing action films since Kill Bill, NYC Movie Guru. So yeah. You got some of the characters right there, some screenshots from the movie. This one has the blue, the movie in 4K with special features. This too has a Blu ray with the movie and special features. Regular Blu-ray, I mean. A new kind of superhero, the making of Kick-Ass. It's on the comic book origin of Kick-Ass. Audio commentary by director Matthew Vaughn. Marketing archive, ass-kicking bonus view mode, Blu-ray only. The art of Kick-Ass gallery, Blu-ray only. So yeah. Um, you just have all that for the 4K Digital Ultra. Violet's Code, rated R. Uh, Region A, 7.1, Lionsgate, so, uh, movie on the 4Ks in 200, or 2000, wait, 2160p, Ultra HD, uh, 69 widescreen, 2.4 all by 1 presentation, Dolby Vision, Dolby, English Dolby Atmos, French Block by 1, Dolby Digital, English 2.0, uh, digital output optimized for late night listening, uh, English 7.1, DTSAC Master Audio, Blu-ray only, uh, English subtitles, Spanish subtitles, English SDH, color feature runtime, approximately 117 minutes. And yeah, uh, as you know, as you guys probably know, regular Blu-rays just have the movies or whatever's on them in 1080p at most. Oh my god. Okay. So uh, here we go with the uh, disc case. So yeah, the front, side, back, same as the slipcover. There's the digital file code, which I already used. So it's useless to people. You got the uh, regular Blu-ray right there, and the 4K disc right there. So yeah, so pretty good. I might eventually get the sequel, because that's coming out for a re-release too. Not in 4K, but it is uh, being re-released on Blu-ray, so... Yeah, might get that, might not. We'll see. So yeah, so link to the description on my shit, subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next one.